Hey everybody, welcome back to Enter the Gungeon. Some quick news. Uh, there is going to be another update to Enter the Gungeon. One that I believe is titled uh, Enter the Gungeon Advanced Gungeons and Dragons, something like that. It's supposed to be um, a play on words for, for D&D. &D. It might not be exactly that, but that's about what it is. Uh, we're playing as the pilot this time. So... Yeah, for that costume. But yeah, the with another update, we will have more content to go through, so we might not yet be done with this game. Granted, we still need to finish this one. 29 Shroomers. Those are the uh, the ones that shoot in opposite or in multiple directions, but like split across you. I don't even know if that makes sense as a description. Everybody knows that I'm not a huge fan of the pilot. That was a bad play. Am I really that rusty? But the pilot does have his advantages. I don't know if I'm going to commit to lockpicking every single um, every single brown chest yet. generally what I end up doing, or want to end up doing. Oh, come on. There we go. Crap. Holy shit. That was really close. Yeah, I'm not gonna pick up that key until we get into the shop. Oh, jeez, I didn't even see that bullet there for a second. Alright, we've already taken some pretty decent damage. The Shroomers shoot like that. That'll split. We don't see them until a little bit later, but they are more common than Shelfie. So 29 more should be like three or four more runs, okay. So I certainly can't abuse them, and, or they're spawning like I could with the skeletons. If I had done a slightly better job of it, we could have gotten in like one run. Can't think it's fine to anything. Alright. that we found one good end. Okay, there's our other chest. It's just a round roundabout. But that roundabout's going to have our boss fight and our shop on it as well. Just what we needed. This probably leads to the chest, since I don't want to open that just yet anyway. Oh, there's a shop. Let's go ahead and check it out. We have friendly face, is that what it is? Let's just get stuff for cheaper. Now that we've gotten that, there it is. 
Yeah, they're about the same distance, so let's go ahead and make a run on that chest. Um, actually, let's wait. I want to see what the other chest is first. So I'll open the one that's better. Or higher quality. Ow. There's so much just debris in this room. Water cube. I'm not aiming perfectly, but this gun is also not particularly accurate. Alright, so it looks like we're opening this chest. If that brown chest is a passive, I may not try to lockpick it. I haven't decided yet. Unlikely that either of those. It's a passive or a use item, and we can use either because we've got uh, the backpack. Is it the backpack? I think it's the backpack. It's just extra space. Yeah, it increases our active item capacity. So we can use whatever is in this chest. Potion of Gun Friendship is actually really good. There we go. Um. I'm gonna wait to pick up that heart. If we get hit again, we can take full advantage of it. Uh, we, per usual, I will try the lockpick on both of these, and if we get both of them, we'll go to the next level. I want to try and line them up as much as I can. It's not happening, though. in a bad position here. RPG is not unwelcome. It's certainly not my favorite thing. Oops, it's over here. All right. It has been chosen. Let's see if we can find a secret room, though. Basically, I always check the shop. Um, so you can't be there. It wasn't there. This is where I'm bad at guessing. Because I just don't know. We're doing the what is relatively considered unwise. There's a water barrel in that room. At that point in time, you don't need a water barrel. Okay, it's the oubliette. But I probably have to use this pistol. I don't have a gun that's, that I would consider good enough. Oh, but we got Shroomish. That's a Shroomish. So this is the right call. We totally want to be going on these down here.
basically any path that increases the number of Shroomish we see is going to be good. Oh my gosh. Five bucks. Dang it. Oh my gosh, the bouncing bullets. I almost got hit so many times there. Another shroomish. Fantastic. Yeah, you guys vomit all you want. I'm not going to be sad about it. It means you're shooting less. I think this is all that spawned for this wave, which I'm totally okay with. by tapping. Unfortunately, I want to dodge roll into the small ones because it's faster. There we go. Some of them were guarding. I am really lucky that missed me. Yeah, I was waiting for that. Luckily, my reaction time was fast enough. Gee, okay. Almost. Yeah, I don't want to pick it up. I don't want to pick it up. It's good that we found one. Oh shoot, 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 shoot. That's the one that, this is what needs to die. More than anything else in this room. There we go. Those rotating, the rotating shots make most of your cover absolutely useless. Unfortunately, these guys are trailing poison but the other enemies in the room are immune. Not every enemy in this level is immune to the poison. A good number of them are, though. Oh, gosh. Another shroomish, at least. I do want to take care of the big mushrooms, but they are much easier to hit. Gotta be careful of the bullets that change their coloring scheme and start flashing. Those will actively target you. I think this one could just fade. Yeah, it takes the mushroom being alive for them to be able to target like that. Unless we get a really good gun here. We found. Oh no! Shit. I didn't notice. There's a key on the shop. Luckily, we have a key, so we can get a key. Oh no, the crestfall is so good. Oh, it's a blue goo on stone. Oh my gosh, so many things I want! But now that we've seen the shop, we can pick up the key. We need to find the other chest, though. Because if it's a better chest... I, I mean, I want it. Okay, as much as I want to prioritize the Shroomish, I gotta get rid of these rifles and... Oh my gosh. If I keep chasing, you know, making them run around... I don't even know how that worked, but it did, so I will complain. Great. Cool. 
We got enough killed. Just close. Oh. Yep, keep vomiting. The one stones are incredibly invaluable. And we are a character that can survive without heat. Not always the best way, but can. That worked out really well. That was lucky. If I had been, if I had not been caught in the door there, I might have rolled into the other shot. Which is what I was expecting to happen, to be quite honest. Right, let's make our way to the other chest. Probably this way. Unfortunately, this guy is immune to fire. That's not a key, so we could open everything. And not buy a key, it seems we could buy the Guan Stone. The Crestfaller is a really good gun. I will buy the Guan Stone first, though. You are priority. You are secondary priority. Oh my gosh. Okay, this guy chasing me around is actually making this significantly harder than I want it to be. Having to constantly run away and avoid bullets that are bouncing. This will do a VRPG. Just in case the secret room is here somewhere. We do have the chest. Okay, well we're gonna open the other chest first. And see. If it's a passive, I will likely uh, lockpick the other one. Because I don't need a... A, a brown tier gun. Okay. It's, it's passive. It's just scorch marks. Oh, damn it. I didn't unlock the door. Just means I have to walk slightly further. It says trusty lockpick. I don't believe that. It's, it's rate of unlocking stuff is really low. I didn't expect him to be south. Ooh, this is an NPC. It's a gun muncher. And this is... that. Okay, we picked that up last so that we've got the best possible chance to actually get it. Hit, I believe time slows down with the blue gun stone. Yep. Alright, well this is the slime, which I'm decent at. Most of the time. 
time. moment and we're dead. Damn it! Oh, that's not great. Ah, oh, blobby lord, why you kill me? Yeah, so there was there wasn't any particular bad oh, wow, we went exactly 20 minutes. Weren't any particular bad decisions made in this run. I guess you could consider buying the guanstone instead of health a bad decision, not picking up. I considered picking up the the uh, armor because uh, it would make us go from two hits to three hits but unsure not you know it's, it's one of those things like i thought i could take out the blobby lord without getting hit twice but i got hit once in a very silly situation because i dodge rolled when i shouldn't have uh basically i should have been trying to stay farther away i don't fight blobby lord enough to make the best uh the best plays against him all the time i it's really one of those things like i like this alternate path but it doesn't always play to what i want to do spending two keys to get there you don't get enough out of it. If there were if there were unlocked chests down here, I would come all the time. Uh, but because it's two extra keys when keys are already pretty much the most valuable resource, um, you know, there's only so much you can do to say, hey, you should really take two keys down here. 25 shooter. So we killed four. Which implies six more runs. Once again, assuming that I don't die, because, <laughs> you know, I've been doing so well about that recently. But, thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed this episode, I will see you next time, but until then, keep your gears turning.